So when the topic of the best rising young stars in the NBA or like the top players under the age of 25 comes up, can someone please explain to me why most of the time, Paolo Bencaro's name is not one of the first names to come up? Like when the topic comes up, like the first names you hear most of the time are like Luca, Shea Gilgis Alexander, Anthony Edwards, and Victor Wimanyama. Very few players did more in this past year's playoffs to cement themselves as Paolo Bencaro did as a rising and future superstar in the NBA. The first overall pick averaged 27 points, almost 9 rebounds, and 4 assists per game in the first round of his first playoff series against Cleveland, including a 38-point game in Game 7. Now, Ben Carroll is the second player in NBA history under the age of 22 years old to average at least 25 points and 8 rebounds per game. And not only that, in his first playoff series, he broke multiple records, like becoming the youngest player in NBA history to score 35 or more points in a Game 7. And he set a magic franchise record for most points scored in his first 7 playoff games with 189. Now, although the Magic lost to the Cavs in 7 games, Ben Carroll has shown that he has all the tools to be the face of the Magic's championship hopes for the years to come. Now, I get that the Orlando Magic is a small market team, but what I can't understand is Wimby, SGA, and Anthony Edwards play for a small market team too. 